Well Steve Jobs is back Steve the first question is how is young Jason. Jason is incredible <laughs> and my name is Steve Gelbs. It's oh. been what I'm so disappointed. Less than two weeks. I'm so disappointed. Is, is that really your name. <laughs> That's my name. Oh. Now what kind of music do you think we're playing on this boat. Obviously we, we don't have the audio capability to be able to find out but just just from the the nature of the the dance steps. What do you what do we think that is. Uh, well I know those two gentlemen don't have a chance. <laughs> Pre-game, a couple hours before the game starts, it's a PB&J sandwich and fruit. Here's the one difference, though. Waka says that Wainwright takes the crust off of his PB&J. Waka <laughs> likes to keep his what? on. What is he, a kindergartner? It's a, it's a little more, a little more mature. <laughs> what is a PB&J? Peanut butter and jelly, oh, my friend. Oh, Jesus. Come on. Keith. You know Keith. what? All this stuff is it's just. It's, it's the first two on. innings. We've already had the horseshoe and the PB&J. <laughs> Speak English, the we, 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 we need to expand your knowledge base. See, I know BLT. <laughs> I've never heard of. I've never heard of peanut butter. I mean, jelly you, sandwich. Just I mean, you like have that. You have grandkids, right? I, you? No, they're. You know what? I remember. They're up. They're out west. They're, I don't see. I don't hardly see them. There's, there's no PB and J west of uh, west of Illinois. Is that how that works? I've never heard that before. Well, obviously, I'm Keith's like, never fed his grandkids. I'm getting out of touch. That's funny. It's a beautiful night, isn't it? Oh, it's gorgeous. What a beautiful day it was. Splitter misses three and one. Was it my? Was it? Was it my phone? I know it, that. It's not a phone. All, it's, all, it's, all, it's, all, it's, I, all I know is someone put something away. No, right it's up. you. It's my front door. <laughs> it's my my camera, and it's got a. It, it's a UPS guy delivering something <laughs> at my front door. I I mean, if you hadn't known that the UPS guy was coming, would that have been okay or? You had to get notification. Uh, it's a new bed for Haji. <laughs> of course it is. <laughs> so I had to keep Haji. the alarm on to make sure that it arrived. Three two to Alcantara. <laughs> right back to Stroman. And the Gold Glover makes the play. Side retire. We go to the bottom of the fourth. <laughs> that was his expression when the phone went off. Oops. Made a noise. That's funny. The, the things I do for Haji. <laughs> well, as you might have heard us uh, refer to, Keith had a bit of an adventure getting here today. I certainly did. Went for my morning. Went for my morning coffee. Decided instead of going straight home like I normally do, there are the boys from uh, Hammer Towing and Wainscott. Uh, I took. There was so much traffic on 27. That I took, the road said Sag Harbor left. <laughs> and it was paved for around a mile, and then it got gravel. There's Elijah, Elijah Osborne. Uh, as you can see, it got so narrow that I, I could, and this young man here, he was a deli delivery truck. That's Jake. And when he came it? down the hill, and I was waving, no, don't come. I'm, I, you can't get by me. Yeah. And he, so he stopped, and he couldn't get reversed back up the hill. So he managed to squeeze by me, and he turned out to be this enormous Met fan. Oh. <laughs> Patrick Mazika shoots one the other way, and he's got the Mets' first hit of the game. So, so, so how did you wind up in a mud puddle? I, I'm not because really the buying this. Because the traffic was backed up. Yeah. The sign said left to uh to Sag Harbor. Sag Harbor. But you had never been on this particular road before. Never had. It's right by East Hampton Airport. It, and um, so I figured, okay, I'll take it. And it was paved, and all of a sudden it wasn't, and it was just one lane, and I couldn't turn around, so I kept going, and I couldn't make the hill. It's a little hill. And so I called my friend. I said, he called Elijah, and Elijah came around an hour later, and they got us out. Um, I was not happy. Had you had your morning coffee at this point? I'd had my morning coffee. And uh, the thing is, too, out there, there's a lot of blind spots on your phone. I was lucky there oh. wasn't a blind spot. I was able to get on the phone and call for help. And a couple trucks came by. It was a little iffy. You could have been, you could have been stuck out there, <laughs> my <laughs> friend. Yeah. Did it rain a lot on the It instant? rained last, the night That's before. Because it looked like, oh. you know, you were in quicksand there. It was right in the middle of the woods. It was a... 
There was, there was a lot of shotgun shells on the floor. Oh my goodness! <laughs> did you hear? Did you hear any banjo music? <laughs> what, what, what? That's how I got. That's that's the hill up up above. What, I, I what would get. one be hunting out there? Grouse? Uh, the birds, <laughs> birds, and deer. And there we are. Oh my! So they pulled me out. Thank goodness. So the, the, the sign should have. Off-road vehicles only. So you got that, uh, East Hampton or Wainscott? It's a good thing that there was some cell service where you were, because oh. otherwise we might have had to send a search party. I was way deep in there too. It would have been a long walk back to the highway. I mean, we, we would have had to send the bloodhounds. Oh. I mean, now that you've given it publicity, there'll be a $10 million home on that property <laughs> like in 30 days. I think if I had the first game, I was in trouble. I'm just glad that you got out safely, Keith. Yes, me too. Coke Zero Sugar, now more delicious. Try it first. <laughs> that's 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 the label. Let me, get, let me let me just try it. I haven't tried this yet. Hold on, no sugar. What do you think? What do you think, Ron? <laughs> <laughs> You're you're handing that to the germaphone. Oh my That's goodness! That's never gonna happen. Oh, I almost I almost left the booth. Oh my god! Oh my oh god! My. Oh, he was he was headed for the high chair. This, this brown skin turned white. In a second. Oh. Can I say one more thing? Go ahead. I love your tie. Well, it's my Seinfeld tie. It's your Dr. Seuss tie. This was, it's one fish, two fish, you know, blue fish. Red fish, blue fish. Yeah, whatever. And uh, Dr. <laughs> Seuss. And the final day of uh, Seinfeld, the final production, they were wrapping up the whole set because that was the final, the final day of shooting. And the wardrobe woman there was just a sweetheart. And... I asked her if I could have this tie, and she gave me this tie. So this is my souvenir from the Seinfeld show.